What's up everybody, we're back. Got a quick video for you today. I've had tons of comments asking this question that I thought I would just make a video to show you instead of explaining in the reply to each comment. And that question is, how do I get my Neural Amp Modeler profiles into Tonocracy? It's a pretty easy process, but it's not as straightforward as it could be, so I'm just gonna show you real quick. I'm gonna use the Fesley today because I just got it. I just made a video about this guitar and I have an affiliate link. I'll put both the video link and the Amazon link in the description. But with that being said, let's get into Tonocracy. This is what Tonocracy looks like when you first open it up. You got a blank slate. If you wanna just use one of the built-in amps, you just Grab an amp, drag it on. If you're gonna use an amp, you're probably gonna want a cab too, so just grab, I always go to gent for some reason. Grab a cab, throw it on. All fine and dandy, but what if you wanna use your NAM profiles? Well, here's how you do it. Get rid of the amp here, X. So the left side of the screen here, the My Library, is just kind of a normal file directory. So under Tone Snaps, I have my NAM profiles. That's not really the best place for it, but whatever. Once you're in one of these main folders, you can right click, and make a new folder. Call it AM Profiles 2. I have a NAM Profiles 1. There it is, it pops up there. I'm gonna open that folder, set the arrows down, so we're in this folder now. I'm gonna go to my File Explorer. You're going to have to navigate to wherever your NAM files are. So this will be different for everybody. It depends on where you put them. I put mine in the Reaper folder, but it doesn't have to be there. It'll be wherever you want. I did that because I didn't really know what Neural Amp Modeler was when I was downloading it. All right, so these are all my profiles. Let's go, let's grab some of these JP2 profiles or grab all of them. So I'm in the folder. I'm gonna shift click and select all of them. Now I'm just gonna drag from the file explorer to my new folder. Boom shakalaka. And there you go. Exit out of the file explorer. Now they're all in Tonocracy and they will always be there. You don't have to keep dragging them over. So now you can just grab one, drag it in. And it really is as simple as that. You just gotta drag them over. The only thing I will warn you about is it is kind of easy to miss here. So you gotta really make sure where you're dragging these. And if you don't have the folder open, so look, if I'm here between NAM profiles one and two. If I drag it here, that's where it goes. So if you wanna put it in the folder, you have to make sure you open the folder. And when you open, when you create a new folder, and you hit open, there's nothing there, so you gotta make sure that arrow's down in that folder that you wanna drag it, and then drag it over. You see how the arrow went in a little bit? That's what you want, now it's in that folder. I hope that makes sense for everybody, it is a little bit tedious, but you gotta do what you gotta do. If you know of a better way to do this, go ahead and leave a comment, let everybody know how to do it. And with that being said, that's all I got. Just a quick short video for you today. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video.